So technical analysis. Now ikija kwenye swala la kufanya decision yote kwenye financial market. Unaweza ukafanya decision zako kwa ku on technical analysis and fundamental analysis. Fundamental analysis ina involve kusoma fundamental reports or bank reports na ita ni news. And technical analysis ina ku involve we kama trader just to lead only price movement. Now kusoma price movement unezu katumia njia za ina tatu. And the each and every trader has to know these kinds of ways now how to lead price movement on the charts. In other words, technical analysis equals to leading, just like I said. With leading charts, every trader approaches, approaches the market or leading price movement just by using first using indicators or moving averages or automated indicators or robots. Some of the traders want to me a robot. I think you have already heard about this. Uh, some do approach uh, price leading or by using price action. So price action ni just kusoma candlestick movement or just leading price leading a candlestick reading okay and indicators for me we never personally never use indicators like moving average sijasema kwamba using moving a uh, moving average kama indicator is is bad no it's not bad though we do say that indicators are lagging behind the market's already selling and is when the indicators telling you hey the market is selling and automated the indicators like low bots ni low bots and was not quite meeting in a certain environment condition market environment condition so the moment market environment changes low bots i always quite identify now it keep working on the environment i'm going to edit in as well now you end up losing maybe the winning rate maybe 75 percent as time goes on the winning rate decreases until zero percent now leading price action in a kusaidia we kusoma price movement just to know when to buy and when to sell just by reading candlesticks now the thing is robots wanna soma candlesticks movement wanna soma price movement they only help you how to when to buy when to sell but within a short term it's not reliable that when the market environment changes they also adapt they don't adapt because they are robots now um Let's see what uh, technical analysis has for us and I will show you vile ambavyo unaweza uka, ukasoma price movement just by reading price action. Now let's let's know what price action is. Price action is when a trader makes trade, trading decision based on chart movements or by leading charts. And price action uses tools like patterns, candlestick patterns, trend lines, market swing structure like upswing and downswing, support and resistance levels, consolidation, Fibonacci retracements, all of these tools in the ambassadors in Akusaidia where just to lead price action. Okay? Just read the candlestick movement. Now for all of these tools in I will show you each and every tool how to use them and how to approach the actual market structure. Now the important reasons why you should lead price action is that price action gives you structure or to the forest market uh, price action also represents corrective human behavior you know you are we have this thing called mass psychology mass psychology when you see uh, each and everyone saying buy now or sell now buy now or sell now each and everyone buying or selling now because the price movement changes uh, price ma, price movements and the behavior changes each and everyone will see like oh, now I need to buy I need to sell COA to I'm gonna gonna feel like I need to buy or I need to sell it's my psychology now through leading price action in a could go could you collective human behavior also number three price action helps you to reduce noise and force signals now for sign like when to buy when to sell when using price action uh it aqua void you could you like when to buy and when to sell now for any trader to study price action properly one has to read price movement which help, uh, helps you with the help of the candlestick features now yeah we have these candlestick features guys and the each and every candlestick feature represents a certain human behavior now for you to lead such human behavior you need to be familiar on reading the candlestick price and the candlestick movement okay so the candlestick is the feature in the market charts which said the previous price and the current price in other words 
candlesticks are the language of the market. One has to tell you that the candlesticks we call them the la the, the the language of the market because in Oxidia we could you when to buy, when to sell, or who is in control of the market. And the candlestick like the, this feature here in a corner open high, open high and uh, just some do say that the upper shadow we also have the open and closing. This is open and this is a closing. It's a closing if it's in a downtrend and say open when uh, it's open low when say in a downtrend now we have this this body this is called the body and we also have this lower shadow lower shadow is where price closes also this is called the row or opening low okay now this is actual structure of the candlestick now each and every candlestick or the candlestick feature we have the bench candlesticks and the bullish candlesticks now the long Candlestick body refers to have the strong buy or the sell pressure and the short candlestick body refers to the little buy or little sell pressure like the one you see here Confano, this is a small body small body represents like combat to a small uh, when one says bearish meaning is selling and bullish meaning buying now in the bearish come in small candle which means kuna sell as you are charging or we have less sellers and this is strong 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 or body meaning that we have more sellers out to sellers wing okay and vice versa for the bullish candlestick structure this small body represent comba to less buyers and this the big uh, body represent comba to na um the more more buyers manake kama ni biashara or let's say any 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 physical market this is a time when they we have more buyers and sellers and this candlesticks represent comba we have less less by bu uh, less buyers in the market it may be during the night if it's the physical market okay kama ni kali yako saa hii ndo usiku na huu muda ndo nda saa so the market is active okay so this is the actual uh, structure of the candlesticks now the the candlesticks movements in a represent certain structures and certain structures does in a way signification whether to buy or to sell now we'll see this candlestick structure how they behave and when to to see them so that you need a buy i'm on as a sell and is candlestick structure they make were divided in two groups and they are only representing either the market to reverse or to continue Confano hapa some of the candlestick structures in a represent reversing reversing i mean if the market is buying for example this the market is buying and the candlestick feature it can happen along the originality of the or the of the trend now a candlestick when i perform the upper tonight and reversing and for this uh, actual trend is ambos not okay mid of the trend to nazita ni continue continuation like this one the continuation now its candlestick patterns are divided into into two groups reversing and the continuation okay now um uh, number one in it one in graphing back and also we also have the dodge candles pattern to now moving and evening star we also have the pin bar or ham and shutting star you also have the haram or inside bar now in this video umejifunza kwamba in the technical analysis to na different approaches of for uh, price movement about to na indicators to na low boots or automation you also have the price action and inside price action unaweza kusoma price movement by using different tools and when is it our trend line patterns or fibonacci tools there are a lot of tools that will show you how to use them and inside price action to na soma price movement kwa kusoma candlestick movement and is candlestick movement is divided into two groups ambao kuna reversing candlestick patterns lakini pia kuna continuation patterns na hizi patterns zipo kwenye ma group matano all five groups all these groups we are going to start them one after another in the next coming video